electrons can also release energy while moving around the nucleus in circular path and it can ultimately fall into the nucleus you can see over here so the structure of atom can be destroyed and if this happens no matter will ever exist in the universe because matter is composed of atoms and this defect was not explained by Rutherford. Next, number three, if electrons radiate energy continuously, then continuous spectrum will be obtained, but actually line spectrum it is obtained. Now, let's start with it now. Spectrum. Now, what is spectrum? Okay. Spectrum, we know that energy, it is emitted or released in the form of heat, light, etc. In the form of waves. You can see these waves. Now, this is crest, as you can see over here. And this is, this is trough. This part is crest and this is a trough. So, we say that the distance between the crest and the trough is called wavelength this is the shorter wavelength as you can see over here and these are the long this is the longer wavelength now spectrum arrangement of light waves into its components components means parts according to increasing or decreasing wavelength let's discuss an example now white light coming from the sun now what is white light white light is a you can say a rainbow colors now white light coming from the sun in the form of waves you can see over here now when light waves it enters the glass prism it splits into seven colors according to their wavelength how now the red color it is clearly visible because its wavelength it is greater longest wavelength and this violet color it is not clearly visible because its wavelength it is very less shortest wavelength so you can see over here it's like a rainbow now if you see over here it is forming a continuous spectrum continuous spectrum means no clear boundary between the color bands now, if you see over here, there is no clear boundary between the color bands. So, we can call such kind of a spectrum as a continuous spectrum. You see that there is no clear boundary between the color bands. Now, if you have a look over here. Now, this is. A continuous uh, spectrum a form of continuous spectrum you can see there is no clear boundary between the colors so it can be called as a continuous uh, spectrum you can can have a clear look over here so so let's continue with our topic this is called as a continuous spectrum now line spectrum Spectrum with clear uh, boundaries between the color bands. Now, if you see over here, there is a clear distinction between the color bands. This is the structure of atom. This is electron. The electron is releasing energy in the form of waves, which is shown by a spectrum over here. Now, these black spaces, these are the, you can say, empty uh, spaces uh, in the atom you can see over here and uh, you can see this uh, boundary so this boundary it is the it is showing the energy released by the electron so it was observed that uh, atom was showing a line spectrum and according to Rutherford electrons continuously revolve around the nucleus in uh, con uh, it's in continuous motion and it should uh, give continuous spectrum 
but it was giving this line uh, spectrum so this was the main defect over here next is it does not provide any explanation about chemical properties of the elements now chemical properties means chemical reactivity of a substance atomic number atomic mass etc so rutherford did not explain the chemical properties of the elements so this was all about the defects in rutherford's atomic model thank you